Oh, I don't... Care if he's still here or not, I'm still not going to fucking keep that. Blockchain.com Hum, 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 hum. There's the other benefit of having this lightning rod page, and that is that people tend to kind of go there and just, you know, they, I guess, uh, you know, the, what people say is that you, you're yourself when you're drunk, <laughs> and, or at least your worst self, uh, your worst self, and you're also your worst self when you're on the internet uh, posting about something you don't like. And so people have gone on this webpage and they've just said things that are just, they're, they're really kind of... They're the kind of red meat comments that trigger more free keen activism and more free keeners. So I want to read to you some of what I have found on this webpage. I can't believe these people are posting this stuff out in public. It's like they might as well be trying to rename their webpage We're the Bad Guys dot com. Here's some examples. The person who appears to be administering uh, the webpage is Andrea Parkhurst Whitcomb. And although, again, I appreciate her dissent, I, I appreciate dissent against almost anything, but... Look at what she has to say about the incident where Graham is threatened by, by a, a tow truck driver. Quote, kudos to this driver. About time people stand up and tell these asses off. Unquote. Kudos to somebody for threatening to kick somebody else in the teeth? Especially if the threat is not, I mean, the threat's not directed against someone who has initiated force. If you're threatening to do that as part of a defensive process, okay, I can, I can see. But you, when you threaten to do that to someone who is just running a video camera in public from, from 20 feet away... That's a pretty questionable thing to condone. And this is coming from the top of Stop Free Keen. Uh, what are some other comments I saw on this? Uh, Brandy Loves Her Family writes, or someone claiming to be Brandy Loves Her Family, quote, I like Alan's idea of purposely calling Emerson's for towing just to shake his hand, unquote. Todd Nolan, or someone claiming to be Todd Nolan, says, quote, the funny thing is, Graham is very lucky. I know the driver. He really would have no problem knocking Graham's teeth out. Graham could have easily defused the situation by stopping the camera when asked to do so. Unquote. Chad Connolly says, Aw, oh, someone cried because he pissed off someone and was told his teeth would be removed. Unquote. Sun Tzu said... <sighs> If you want to defeat an enemy that is united, you must divide them. And that's actually what's happening on this page, because there are quite a few quotes here where people are turning around and saying, wait, no, I don't I don't advocate violence against Graham. So, there, so what's happening is the Stop Free Keen movement is sort of, there's a little bit of a division that this is creating between them. And the ones that, that love to see someone's teeth, their teeth kicked in for running a camera, and others who are... They're starting to realize, wait a minute, that I'm not sure we is that what we want? Uh, Dr. King said, or actually Gandhi said, for, for a, a piece of violence to, you know, for an injustice to be stopped, you have to first make it visible. And I think that's, you know, that's a little bit of what Graham has accomplished here. Uh, I don't care if he's still here or not, I'm still not going to do that. The uh, the real jerks on the Stop Freaking page, or so, are so, they're sort of being flushed out into the open. 
They're saying the kinds of things about free staters that people will go to great lengths today to pretend they never said about the civil rights movement. Others, the real men in the crowd, the real women in the crowd, are uh, at least apologizing for what they may have said back in the 60s. Someday, maybe some of these folks will get a chance to do the same. By the way, the market is starting to speak regarding the behavior by the towing person. The company's Facebook page is, uh, I guess, is you know, it, you can review the company. And people are starting to pour into this Facebook page to give them one-star reviews, you know, one star out of five, uh, and question the behavior of the employee for threatening the person just standing there doing First Amendment and failing to follow orders to blindfold his viewers. We'll see how this all shakes out, but like I said, I'm glad that Stop Freaking is there because a broken clock will be right twice a day. There will be times where they have legitimate concerns and grievances, and there will also be times where they just uh, behave like jerks and get us more attention. If I can be considered part of us. Blockchain.info's free Bitcoin web wallet, chock full of privacy and security features, Two-factor authentication, a second password for sending coins. They never have control over your passwords or your coins. They don't even require your personal info. Get yours today at blockchain.com. Um, 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 um.